Hey there, my name is Tobin Carpenter and I'm an MSP consultant at Proval Tech. Today, I want to go over how to reset a user's two-factor authentication for their VSA account. In the case of a user losing access to their mobile device that contains their key, or if there's a specific use case where gaining access to the two-factor authentication code is not feasible, you're able to very easily reset the 2FA on the account and reconfigure it at the next login. Let's get started. First place we're going to go, we're going to head down to System. Then under Server Management, we're going to select Login Policy. Once you select Login Policy, you've got your two-factor authentication settings located down here. You also have Specify Password Strength Policy, which we talked about in our last video. If you haven't seen that, make sure to go check it out. So what are the options we have here in two-factor authentication? How long should 2FA devices be remembered? This is going to allow your browser to cache uh, and keep that code, keep that login, I should say, for a specific amount of time. Some people like to uh, like to have it at 30 days, which is the default. There are other options in this. Don't do this one. Don't do that. So let's talk about how to actually remove the 2FA from the account. So the first thing that you're going to want to do select remove users from 2FA enrollment. Then let's select the account that you're wanting to remove the 2FA from. So I'm going to select my own account and I'm going to select remove. You'll get a message now that says one users were removed from 2FA enrollment. Select OK. And you'll see that instead of a green check mark, I now have a red X, which means that my 2FA enrollment is not configured. So the next time that account goes to log in, let's first log out. Give that just a moment. When the account logs in, the user will be prompted to set up 2FA. They'll see this window first. Let's select next. Then you can use any application that you like. I particularly prefer Authy, but use that application, get your QR code, get your authentication code, put that code in, click submit. And now that account is again secured by 2FA on the device that you just configured it for. Let's give it a moment, just a moment here to load. And as we scroll down again from the same page, you will now see that my account has the green check mark, which means that it is enrolled. And thanks for watching our video today. We post a new video every week to share our knowledge on VSA. To learn more about what we do, visit ProvalTech.com or click the link in the description below. Thanks.